Today we will introduce how to slug a liquid pump. When you have some liquid to be transferred into your system, you have to select it a liquid transfer device. It will be a pump, but it's not limited by a pump. It may be a syringe pump, uh, it may be a plastic pump, or other liquid transfer pump. When we select it, a pump, there will be several parameters we have to be considered. First is the materials we have to be transferred. You must be considered about uh, chemical compatibility of the pump materials related with your target transfer chemicals. You need to make sure the materials is affordable and uh, suitable for the transfer region. So this one, if you are interested, you can call us to resource the table to refer that what types of pump hand or tubes or syringe you have to be selected. The second one is uh, flow rate. Uh, as our experience, you we recommend your flow rate range is loading uh, in the 10 times of the milli flow and 50% of the max flow. This is not only consider about the accuracy, but also consider about the protection of the pump or the protection of the tubes. Second is the accuracy. The accuracy of the pump was determined by the rotate speed in unit time. Then you need to be considered about the accuracy to make sure the selected pump can make can suitable for your accuracy. This is related with the resolution of the pump and also the design accuracy of the pump. The last one we have to be considered about the stability is the related quality of your device. And the most important, we need to be uh, considered with another one is uh, about a uh, pressure that uh, mostly we may be not being pay attention because mostly the liquid we transfer is under atmosphere but uh, in some types of reactions it may be contain a pressure that we are using so at that moment you must consider about the maximum pressure that your pump can be provided to make sure the liquid can be uh, inlet into your system properly with the consideration of these parameters, mostly you can got a suitable pump for yourself. There is a table uh, that we recommended when you select a plastic pump. Pay attention to the rotate speed, the, this one, the uh, milliliter per rotate per minute. To this is related with the resolution of your pump. Um, mostly when you are require higher accuracy or your transfer amount is uh, very uh, small you have to be have a higher resolution and uh, another one is uh, the minimum flow of the pump can be transferred make sure the target transfer Minimum flow is at least about 10 times to maintain the accuracy. Pay attention to the max flow uh, because when the max flow was provided, mostly your pump need to be working on its maximum speed. That is not only uh, affect the life of the pump, but also affect the tube's life. We can see here in this table, when the speed is slow, the pump will be have much longer life, this unit in hour. But when your uh, speed is very fast, then the tube life will decrease immediately. There's uh, several uh, tubes have its different uh, lives. 
you can refer. So when you selected uh, two, you have to not only uh, consider about the step the, the stabilities uh, which is suitable but if there is uh, several materials is suitable you can choose uh, the most uh, longer life one to save your budget uh, another way to save the budget is you use uh, extension connection and to isolate the tube for pump with the tube to the device then every time when you replace the tube you just uh, replace a salt uh, salt lens one no need to replace all to affect the whole system the adapters uh, you can call us to resource uh, suitable adapters for your system uh, with the consider of all the parameters and uh, the experience result we are sure you will got a suitable pump with uh, uh, saving money and the most uh, eco uh, solution for your transfer of your fluid thanks and any problem you can contact with us about this issue